You're listening to Voices of School Success, an inside look at progress and problems in Hamilton County school reform. This program is produced by the Public Education Foundation, a Hamilton County school partner whose mission is to improve student achievement in our community's public schools. To be notified of future podcasts and other information on Hamilton County public school reform, sign up for the PEF email newsletter at www.pefchattanooga.org. We are so excited to be here today. We are here today planning and collaborating and learning about Know How to Go, which is a new college initiative um, plan that we're going to implement at East Lake Academy so that we can get every eighth grade student off to college. We know that the earlier a student looks or thinks of themselves as college bound, that they're more likely to do well in their classes and ultimately to go to college. I think eighth grade's even too late. We need to start earlier and I think some of the things that we're going to do with eighth grade and focus on eighth grade uh, is going to fall back to sixth and seventh. Today's retreat was um, essentially uh, the kickoff for the initiative, which will go for two years and that the teams were planning their activities. Every school um, has a college tour for every eighth grader included in their plan. This is funded through the initiative, so every eighth grader will be on a college campus at some point this, this school year. Um, they also have in their plans individual conferences with every eighth grader to talk about explore results, to talk about planning for high school, um, to talk about that transition and how important it is to do well right off the bat in high school. So many times they have that desire to go, but actually taking the steps to get there is a different story. And so understanding that there are people, there are resources that will get them the information necessary so that they can get there and to push themselves. So many times we're, we're okay with just doing the bare minimum. Well, bare minimum won't get you into college when you have to compete with so many people. And so for them to understand, take those tough courses now because if you plan to go to college, it's so important to have that strong foundation. Got this information now. Let's turn it into something productive that you've created because it's all about you, okay? So we want to look at writing academic goals. When we talk about college with students, what we really mean is post-secondary education. And that could include a four-year degree it, beyond that. It could include a two-year degree. It could include a technical certificate program or an apprenticeship because we know that there are different paths to get to a successful job. And so st it's all about helping the student find the right fit. It like prepares you for high school and like you'll know what, since you've seen your score, you'll know what classes you need to take. I liked it and I thought it was a different tool for her as far as setting her goal, setting her in a direction in a way to go towards high school and her college decisions. We want to make sure if we can start the foundation now and get the ball rolling, then it's easier and we can continue to build that capacity in the future so that all of our students, they know coming into sixth grade that you come through here, the plan is you're going to college and we're going to help you get there. We hope you enjoy this PEF podcast of Voices of School Success. To be notified of future podcasts and other information on Hamilton County public school reform, sign up for the PEF email newsletter at www.pefchattanooga.org.